Hi, this is Kelly Pollard, also known as Matcha, and this character is in Second Life in the Kingdom of Jordan, and I'm wearing what's called a burqa. It covers from head to toe, even when it's 120 degrees outside, women in Saudi Arabia and in many Islamic country, uh, cultures will wear this uh, sort of clothes. So, let's take a tour. As you can see, uh, this is uh, decorated for Christmas. They do celebrate Christmas as a festive occasion here and throughout most of the Middle East. I was surprised by that, but so it is. I'm going to go now to Etek Island. So here we are on Etek Island, and I'm going to show you a couple of things. Uh, the lesson that I created for the class here, and the store that I created. So if you follow this walkway, I'm going to walk a little faster. You come to my store, and everything in here is for sale if you're interested in that sort of thing. And so then uh, coming back out, you can see I constructed something that sort of almost looks like a mosque. <laughs> And there's a windsock out front. Now, that place we went to, the Kingdom of Jordan there, you can get a landmark to that kingdom, as well as to the Kingdom of Saudi Arabia, with the menus here, and some other places, like, for example, there's um, a wonderful build that uh, simulates uh, ancient Egypt, and some other fun places to go. And what the way I use these, uh, I'm learning Arabic here. I'm now in the country of Bahrain, which is an island off the coast of Saudi Arabia and I'm uh, learning Arabic. So what I put together here is a brief lesson on uh, etiquette in this part of the world and ha how to learn the n symbols that are rep used to represent numerals in this part of the world. Most all of Northern Africa, most of the Middle East, um, and other countries that, that don't even speak Arabic also use these symbols to represent numbers. On the way it works, you can click on a number. Wahid. 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 One. And you get to hear uh, the correct pronunciation for the symbol. And I'll also tell you what um, symbol in English it represents. So, this is Wahid. Ifnin. Zalatha. Arba. Kamsa. Sita, Saba, Thamanaya, Tisa, and Ashra. So this here at the top, this is a picture of Mecca, which is in Saudi Arabia. And uh, all Muslims at some point in their life are supposed to come here as a pilgrimage, as part of their faith. And you can also see the photos are some examples of clothing that uh, most of the folks in this part of the world will also, uh, you'd see them wearing out on the streets. And that is my tour of my virtual world, and I hope that you enjoyed it. Thanks for watching.